Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration um, reading for the Sun, Moon and Rising Leos. And I want to say to you, Leos, it's all about the money for you guys in this month. It is wonderful. Okay, this month has been, since I'm doing the readings, um, very excited, very strange, very weird and that sort of a thing. I want to say to you, Leos, thank you so much for the wonderful experience, for the wonderful support that you have been doing for me. And... Um, this is so profoundly surprising I wasn't aware of how um, meaningful these readings were to you Leos but I want to say thank you so much and I'm sending you love and light this month I mean this month is going to be the month of the the hermit but for you guys oh my god it's as if you have found the the inner light the inner wisdom of how to manifest money in this month of august but it's all about you and i can imagine why because it's your birthday the two first weeks in august is going to be your birthday month so for the leas who uh, or you're going to have birthday in August <laughs> trust me <laughs> it's going to be a lucky year for you guys uh, with a sense of your money for your financial situation security balance so the ace of Pentacles the ace of cups you know the daughter of cups is going to be super 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 for you Leo so congratulations at least because I was wondering oh my god this is like I am working with three four dimensions and um, all the energies the information have been coming in through, through different dimensionals for other um, sign and you Leo's I did your reading it is so wonderful so it's all about the monies um, money and love in this month it's gonna be profoundly wonderful for you Leo's so congratulations so you have found your inner light whatever it is because it's working for you in this month again the hermit is going to be the energy vibration for the month so it's going to be a water month but it's going to be good love and money is here um it's going to be profoundly wonderful so whatever is happening okay so what we're looking at is that um um, you're beginning the month with your zodiac energy vibration you end the month with an um, earth element which is good because the ending of the month is going to be profoundly wonderful for you Leo so no matter what is happening the only thing that I've seen in your month is in the second week with love and money so people who are having relationships there's going to be um, jealousy with money in your relationships in the second week jealousy with money in your relationships in the second week so this is how it's looking for you and this month is going to be five weeks this five weeks um, as uh, we're beginning the month with a surprise with the energy of the earth energy where the second week is going to be all about love the energy of the lovers third week is about the tower the tower energy comes in to remove whatever that was blocking you and um, the fourth week is the energy of balance justice comes in and justice has to do with the fad of the pentacle so let's say but it's it's whatever it is it has to do with a situation with business business for some people it's business for some people it's home for some people it can be university college that sort of a thing but you have to deal with the king of pentacles in the third week in the fourth week we have the energy vibration of the ace of cups another ace so you have the ace of pentacles and the ace of cups and this ace of cups is wonderful so is so wonderful because the ace of cups you have the energy of the soulmate connection and the twin flame and what is so strange for you Leos is that for the rest of the sign it was really this energy of the soulmate and twin flame relationship was coming in in the second week and you have it in the last week which is the end of your zodiac energy birthday for the year 2017 and the earth energy so you're starting 2018 um, you're starting your 2007 zodiac energy of love wonderful because remember that the zodiac energy for you guys of love in the in the year 2017 it was all about relationships so a lot of you are going to co connect and meet your soul family and also meet your so your twin flame relationship so this is going to be profoundly wonderful new life new things is coming in your life I seems to be taking up um, two cards all the time new life the ace of ones is going to be your outcome of this month the ace of ones is going to be the outcome of your your month so this is going to be performly wonderful seeing that two people are having birthdays in this month 
um, for you Leo's it's going to be the ace of ones that is coming out so new life new beginnings for you Leo's for the month of August congratulations okay I'm going to go in the readings and we're going to look at the first week the first week we have the energy of balance which is wonderful bringing balance in your life is going to be wonderful and with that balance you have the ten of Pentacles ladies and gentlemen there is going to be um a surprise this is going to be an X and surprise to you guys this this is going to be a huge surprise to you guys whatever is happening here you have the energy vibration of the ace the ten of Pentacles a surprise um, it's coming into you Leo's and this is going to be wonderful a real good surprise this is going to be something that you guys weren't really expecting but a huge surprise is coming into you Leo's and this is going to be unbelievable unexpected whatever it is it's going to be um, unexpected an unexpected surprise is just going to come in so this is going to be wonderful so be aware of this um, whatever it's going to be in and and that is going to be the zodiac energy of your um, birthday so you guys expect um, unexpected money coming in a huge surprise financial balance for you Leos so you Leos as we look at the second week in the month of August we have the energy of love and the ace of Pentacles so as I've said is that um, you are going to have a um, jealousy jealousy and uh, jealousy and it's going to be ah, oh, it's, it's not going to be nice um, there's going to be real problems coming in your life there's going to be huge jealousy coming in for you guys whatever the situation is uh, um, it's all about money it's in your relationship uh, there is going to be quarrels fight over money and that sort of a thing but it's more jealousy it's jealousy that you have reach um, people are just jealous your partner and it's all about jealousy and greed jealousy and greed so whatever is happening in your relationship with money and it's going to affect a lot of people it doesn't really matter who you are out there this energy of your relationship with jealousy and greed it's going to be happening it, whatever does say come out is always of oh, with jealousy and greed so be aware of this people be aware of this because this is not a nice energy to be dealing with because the ace of Pentacles is here and then you have people but minded and being jealous of you it's, it's not one of the easiest thing to work with in the for third week we have the tower and the tower comes up with the energy of the daughter of cups the daughter of cups and this is wonderful whatever the situation is with you and your daughter and if this person is and Pisces a cancer or a scorpion be aware and as so it's as if you could not see your daughter for a while and now you finally is going to see your daughter either your daughter or a son um, and you're being happy so this third week is really for the men it's it's really it's going to be a wonderful thing for you men for for the people who haven't seen their kids for a while who weren't supposed to see their kids for a while and that sort of a thing this is going to be brilliant this is going to be wonderful for some people whatever that was happening and blocking that you could not um, um, like a kid there was um, you or your partner had miscarriage and that sort of a thing now a child is going to come in your life now a child is going to come in your life so um, sometimes it's uh, just changing um, position places and that sort of a thing and you're going to see that uh, um, whatever that was blocking this child this you know whatever the miscramp was uh, th this time you're going to be really successful in getting pregnant so congratulations this is wonderful because whenever you accept the um, invitation of a child to come in your life it's going to be extremely wonderful so for you men and women out there especially the women who has been trying to get pregnant it's going to happen in the third week or sometime in August it doesn't have to be really in the third week it can be sometime in August as we look forward and we're looking at the fourth, the fourth week we have the energy of justice and with the energy of justice we also have another 
daughter of pentacles we have the daughter of pentacles so this is going to um, the daughter of pentacles and whatever the energy of the daughter of pentacles if there was an imbalance with whatever situation for some people you will be um, getting information that uh, you are a uh, um, you're eligible or approved to buy a house for some people for some people you'll be getting messages that um, your house will be sold for some people you'll be getting messages that um, if you're looking for a new apartment or that sort of a thing but it's more of a house that it's sold or you're going to buy a new house this is good uh, for some people it's going to be that your child is going to finally come and live with you because um, um, the courts say that you know it's better that your child come going to come and live with you so this is a, another wonderful um, energies for some people it's going to be in business this is the king of Pentacles and for some people in business this is going to be wonderful because the king of Pentacles is someone who is going to be extremely good maybe you have a legal situation between you and the king of Pentacles and um, he is going to um, you know he he has a good strong hold so be, be aware of what is happening but the energy of the Pentacles of the king of Pentacles is here and this can be a very good business partner for you whether as a man or a woman um, the Pentacles people are very good in business so whatever is happening because there is justice there is a king of Pentacles and there is a business and it can also be a house it can be an a whole unit of uh, whatever is happening this person is a good person that is going to come in your life okay so whatever it has whether it's on the negative side of the positive side learn the lesson that it is teaching you in the last and fourth week we have the intuition and the intuition uh, is the energy of the moon the feminine side your intuition a lot of you are going to find true love a lot of you, your soulmate and your twin flame, is as if the universe step in and decide to deliver your soulmate and your twin flame relationship. And this is so beautiful. This is so wonderful. I'm so grateful for you guys because whenever the moon intuition, that means it's your spirit guides and the spirit guides of your twin flame and soulmate are working together to bring you both together. And this is wonderful. This is such a wonderful, wonderful wonderful sign for you guys okay so as we break down your week the first week is going to be a surprise coming in the second week for the men whatever is happening with your children it's going to be wonderful because you're going to get to connect connect with your with your children in the third week in the second week there is going to be um, quarrel over money between you and your partner whoever that person is or whoever but there is going to be jealous about money with you and as your significant half so be aware of this in the third week whatever situation is happening that the king of Pentacles comes in to help you uh, whether in a business uh, um, way or um, in partnership in business or whatsoever um, it's going to be good and the last week these two last week because here is the fourth week here is the fifth week it's going to be extremely extremely wonderful so you Leo's are going to be so profoundly surprised in this month love is going to be in the fourth in the five, five fifth week and this is new love this is a love that is sent from the universe this is blessings from the universe that is coming in this is positive positive blessings from the universe that is coming in in the form of love in your soulmate and twin flame relationship in the last week so love is going to be profoundly um, if evident in the last week you're going to be meeting your twin flames and soulmate what is happening in the second week is that whosoever or in relationships with partnerships there is going to be huge um, quarrel discussions over money is there's going to be so much jealousy going on let's see what the astrologues for the Sun sign people is happening for you Leah's for you Leah's for the Sun sign people okay for the sun sign people let me get my glasses okay we reach by the sun sign um, for the Leo's okay what do we have and let's look at it like this what do we have for the Leo's for the sun sign 
we have uh, Uranus coming in we have Neptune coming in and we have the Capricorn so this is good so here we are which is a um, and the universe is, 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 is showing you something the Sun sign people are going to be working with Uranus Uranus okay Uranus and Neptune Uranus and Neptune is connecting Neptune is the planet of uh, uh, wisdom from Atlantis and Lemuria and this is good because the Sun sign people are going to get this energy of intuition because normally it's uh, the people who are the moon sign always get Neptune working with them but the Sun sign people are going to have Neptune working with them with Uranus so they want to push you to connect to your spirit guides the next energy is the Capricorns and this is good because some of you are going to be connecting with Capricorn people and this is going to bring in a lot of business opportunity and also love okay so whatever is happening for you Leo's it's going to be wonderful you Leo Sun moon people are going to be working with the planet of Uranus Neptune and the Capricorns and this is going to be good the Capricorns are going to bring in good business a disposition for you um, Leo so you know you guys are going to be very happy because with Uranus is that it has to do with you, you who you are and your inner self your inner beam and connecting with that and Neptune is going to help you to connect to information that was left in Atlantis and Neptune and uh, Atlantis and Lemuria and then the Capricorns are going to come in as business partners and help you so this is going to be extremely positive for you Leo so as we look at the Leo moon people let's see what is going to happen for the Leo moon people what is going to happen for the Leo moon people what is going to happen for the Leo moon people we have Venus love I told you guys oh my god and we have Mars that has to do with your career and letting go of what no longer serves you okay so this is good so let's look at this this is what is going to happen for the Leo the moon people the Leo moon people first we have the planet of Venus coming in which that is going to affect you in the last week and the second week it's all about love in the last week and the second week what else do we have we have the planet of Mars Mars is going to release you of that which no longer serve you and is going to help you to vibrate at higher energy vibration and move you forward to something much more beautiful in your life what is going to happen with Sagittarius the Sagittarius are going to come in and connect with you and it's going to help you to bring in luck in your life so this is going to be extremely positive so look out for these Sagittarians and these Capricorn people who are going to come in your life in this month of um, August and bring wonderful blessings, blessings and surprise. Venus, the planet of love, is going to be working with you to bring in your soulmate and your twin flame. So this is going to be wonderful. And the Sagittarius are going to be very, very, very wonderful to you because they are going to help you to um, um, find... Um, um, positive um, um, luck in your life so this is going to be also lucky for you and your end result remember it is new life it is the ace of ones this is going to be your end result at the end of August so this is going to be good as we move forward we're working with the vibrations of uh, um, the vortex and let's see for you um, Leo's what is going to happen for you Leo's this is just going to be wonderful because your reading is so positive I intend to see the best in everyone oh my god this this is this is perfect I intend to see the best in everyone and you Leo is supposed to really hold on to this motto hold on to this motto I intend to see the best in everyone you can never consistently motivate anyone anybody to anything but when you see the best of them and you go over to where your vision of best of them is 
and you align with that and offer one signal now you are part of an inspirational that you see have you ever had bad uh, have you ever had bad experience yourself when someone sees you and loves you and expect the best of you do you not shine in ways you never shine before and do you not find it really hard to shine when other does not look for the best in you isn't that so true people yeah it's you know again have you ever had that experience yourself when someone sees you and loves you and expect the best of you yes do you not ever shine in ways you never shine before yes and do you not find it really hard to shine when another doesn't look for the best in you yes so here we are again facing ourselves it is the week of uh, the hermit and with this last message you're going to see that positive positive changes are going to come in because your end result is the ace of one uh, ace of ones and this is going to be wonderful so this is one of the best best reading I've done in this month because this month has so much vibrational energies that was <sighs> so and when I say to you Leah's congratulations again apparently the year 2017 is also going to be a wonderful year for you guys because we can see wonderful new positive energies coming in I want to say to each and every person out there go connect with yourself find your inner truth find your inner light and share that light and spread that light so that everyone can be um, ill with that light and I want to say thank you for being here please like share send thumbs up thank you thank you thank you so much for your support and namaste until next month